Hai, halo sobat semua selamat datang kembali di Paijo Gaming Kembali lagi bersama Bang Eki, apa kabar kalian semua? Semoga kita semua selalu dalam keadaan yang sehat dan selalu dijauhkan dari segala macam penyakit dan virus-virus Serta yang lagi sakit, selalu godain semoga kalian cepat sembuh ya, Biar seru nonton Paijo Gaming ya, biar sehat ya. Oke, baik lagi dalam walkthrough gameplay GTA Vice City Dan sekarang kita sudah mencapai episode 4 Yang mana kita akan kembali melanjutkan perjalanan ya, si Tommy Vice City lagi Namun, eh uh, kayaknya untuk series ini, walkthrough-nya Vice City Ini formatnya akan gue ubah, yang mana formatnya itu akan seperti episode kemarin di episode 3 itu Karena untuk voice over itu cuma ada di intro aja Jadi setelah ini, pas masuk gameplaynya itu sudah tidak ada voice overnya lagi Supaya apa? Supaya mempercepat walkthrough ini selesai Karena walkthrough ini tuh uh, cukup banyak ya, misinya tuh ada 65 Jadi gue usahain untuk selesai secepatnya, maka dari itu uh, gue pilih format yang sekarang ini Jadi kalian nonton walkthrough-nya aja, gak usah pakai voice over gue gitu ya eh. supaya apa supaya cepet gitu dan kenapa nggak dipakai di live streaming Vice City-nya nanti e, karena si Vice City-nya memang masih diperlukan untuk konten gitu ya nanti kalau misalnya Vice City-nya udah tamat kita langsung bisa bikin analisa-analisa di Vice City juga kita gitu ya. kayak dibully juga kita gitu ya, intinya oke okay. e, sebelum masuk ke videonya jangan lupa untuk memberikan like dan subscribe terlebih dahulu serta yang punya Instagram bisa follow gue di @paijogaming dan kalau kalian mau support gue lebih jauh bisa gabung di membership Paijo tapi kalau kalian nggak mau juga nggak apa-apa cukup like dan subscribe aja selamat menyaksikan dan semoga terhibur Mr. Versetti, Colonel, thank you for coming. Please sit. Lobster. No, thanks. Uh, I am ashamed to admit that one of the causes of our mutual problem appears to have been the loose tongue of a man I used to trust. I've been carrying Gonzalez for years, but now his incompetence reaches new heights. It's only right that you kill Gonzalez. Did he do it? It's the money that's important to me. For well, this kindness, I'll reward you. And then We will find your money together. He will be at his penthouse, half drunk probably. Use this. I'm gonna shut that big mouth of yours. Uh, he's got a blade. Stop running, you fat slime ball. Away from me, you cheap bastard! Don't make me angry. Okay, this is ten, ten, one. South, <laughs> five point. I see him. The front was ten, seventy-seven. South, five point. Now look here, son. I got a problem, and I reckon you could help me with it. I'm no builder. No, I was thinking more of your demolition skills. Now this here, this is the development as planned, and this, this is the property that we're looking at. 
You're trying to say this new office block is kind of in the way. You catch on quick. Now, I'm gonna head out of town for a while, and if that office development would have faced sudden and insurmountable structural problems, then I... As a civil-minded individual, you feel obliged to step in and save the rejuvenation of an important area of the city. Where can I get more guys like you? Ay, no, que le pasa, idiota! What's that about, pal? Watch it, I got the death grip.
kill the Maoists. Me to drill you? 